today I'd like to talk a little bit about the KYC update process and KYC means know your client if you're unfamiliar with that term. It's very important that we compile all the information uh, that we possibly can about you and your family so we can make the right decisions for you and your family and their financial uh, well-being. Uh, it's also a regulatory requirement that we do that every one to three years. Now aside from the typical you know, name, email address, telephone number, uh, questions that we need updated for obvious reasons. Other uh, questions that we'll ask are any changes in employment, any changes in income, have your investment objectives changed? Just things like that that we need to know in order again to make the right decisions for you. We also need to know the number of dependents that you have because we, you know, we want to take into account your whole family and there is opportunity for your dependents to start investing for education, for saving for a home or just general investing. Another reason why we want to know about your employment situation is that if you lose jobs or are in between jobs, maybe you need some of your uh, investments to generate income. A reason why we ask if you have else assets elsewhere, like in a group plan, because we don't want to duplicate efforts at National Bank Financial with what you're doing at, uh, in your group plan or uh, your defined contribution plan. Bottom line, KYC obviously is a regulatory requirement, but it's also a requirement for us, and we think the onus is on us, for us to get to know you as well as we can, to make the right decisions for your family.